This is our road we're driving. We're pretty sure this is it. We're hoping this is it. Should be heading up to the top of that mountain right up there. This is where we're driving. All right, everybody, here we are. This is going to be, oh, what is it? Mount Eagle, the Mount Eagle hike. So um, we are going to hike and look for a geocache. It's the highest point in St. Croix, just over a thousand feet. Uh, we're heading up to the top of this mountain. I'm trying to get around these trees so you can see the top. So anyway, we're heading up that trail. See you in a minute. to show you this bug here's a millipede i know you may not have them where you live they're completely harmless they have a bunch of legs yeah. see there see all the legs on there levi yeah Sweet. There all right this one? back to hiking hike. old mongoose just ran across the road what are the chances as you can see some people drive through here there's four wheelers and stuff i'm sure that's where the mongoose went in I don't think he's there anymore. Sneaky little creatures. Looks like there's a fork in the trail. Hey, I've always heard if there's a fork in the road, take it. <laughs> uh, so do we go there or there? There. Well, half of a split. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, I'm gone. All right, well, we'll see you guys when we figure out where it is. Our wasps on the island are called Jack Spaniards. This is their nest. Kind of what makes them dangerous. They build their nest on the tips of these branches and it looks like a dead leaf but if you shook that thing right now you'd be hurting seth a couple years ago got stung in the face and it swelled his eyes shut oh all right to the next all right so right here we have this red looking tree as you can see it's pretty big these are called turpentine trees scientifically but they're actually on the island called tourist trees because they're red and their skin just peels right off See? That's why they're called tourist trees. So yeah, pretty interesting. See you guys in the next interesting thing. All right, you see these trees in the forest? They fall down, they take up that whole root system. Usually it's storms soften the ground and the wind blows them down. Really, it just makes me want to have my metal detector. All right, to the All right, top. But it probably looks invisible to you right now, but as I get closer, you're gonna be able to see a massive, I think it's a banana spider. It is huge. It's got to be the size of my index finger right there. I mean, that thing is massive. Okay. All right, here we go. It's a car. I don't know if you can see that. It's orange. Uh, it looks like it may be the General Lee. I'm not sure. It's an orange car <laughs> in the woods. The woods are claiming it, I guess. This is the windshield here. It's either the windshield or back glass, one of the two, but that is sweet. All right. We're halfway there. Living out of oh boy. Can y'all hear these mongoose fighting? That's crazy. So I'm sure you guys have heard of termites before. There's a little small one. Some nests are bigger than me, but this one is just a little, I think one's dead actually, it's probably inactive. Anyway, still pretty cool. All right, I think we're getting pretty close here. It is like way cooler up here. It's gotta be like 70, 70 degrees probably, 74. And the wind is blowing really hard. I would say that you're right, Seth. That looks old. 
Whatever it is. The geocache here. So me and Seth have already found the geocache. Right there. And um, <laughs> these three are looking for it. I heard you right next to this well looking thing. It looks very old. I don't know what it is. Trees have grown around it. Cold's pretty hot. But you guys are all pretty hot right now. Where were you? I was right here moving this rock. You're pretty hot. Oh, I think I see it. Yep. Really? <laughs> it's back there. Levi, go get it. There's also a uh, marker. I don't, yep. What are those called? Elevation markers? Probably, yeah. It's put there by the government. Yep. No, not that. See the bag? There you go. Bring it here. Bring it here. You haven't gotten it yet? No. You guys just we haven't touched it. it. Good job, Levi. Oh. All right, here we are. We found the geocache. Ooh, it's dirty. Open it up. We need to sign the log and everything, boys. It was right back there through the woods. You can probably see the marker, the elevation marker right there. Sweet. All right, we're gonna put it right back. We don't know what your opinion is on TV shows, but in We Dig It's opinion, Phineas and Ferb is the greatest TV show ever. And one example of that is the song played by Love Handle. There's a line in it. And it says, like a ninja of love, rappelling down from above, you snuck your way right into my heart. Greatest show ever. All right, everybody. We are at the top of Eagle Mountain, the highest mountain on St. Croix. Be careful, boys. Don't fall off the cliff. And this is what it looks like. You can see all the way down there, that's where the finery right there. You can see a bay right there. Let's go over here where these boys are. You can see more houses down there. This is truly amazing. If you can stand over here, you get the best breeze ever. The breeze is really strong. Nobody go far than this. The highest point on St. Croix. How beautiful. Taking off. Heading to Florida, no doubt. Alrighty, so we are on the way back. Been walking for maybe five minutes. The other ones are coming around that corner soon. I can hear them. Seth's pulling ahead. And I'll get you guys when we get to the bottom. There are tons of butterflies. I'm trying to see if I can get one on video. Seth probably scared them all away. There's one. Whoa. There are a bunch. I think we're getting pretty close to back to the beginning. Well, see you guys later. What a hike. It was good. Now we're heading back. We're Thanks for going along. What a drive.